<laughs> Yo, that sounds super sick. That sounds super sick. Like. Yo, so in my last video, I jumped into Ableton Live 11 and I had such a blast trying it out. And today I'm back to give it another chance. And big shout out to everyone that showed like a lot of support in the comments in my last video, helping me out with the terminologies and everything. And also just telling me how long they've been using Ableton. Okay, so right now I'm on the mixer and I noticed that I can use tab to switch between the pages, like the mixer page and like the, I don't know what you call this, the, the playlist, the arrangement. <laughs> I'm gonna need y'all help again. <laughs> what do you call these pages again? And my tempo is at 120 and I'm gonna go into sounds. I'm gonna go right here into sounds and I'm gonna look for something that can, that I can create chords with. Wait, these are actually chords, wow. Okay, let me drop that in and see what I can do with this. Okay, I think that's it. I just don't like how it somehow kind of deletes, like it deletes over like if, if it loops. So I think I need to record out of loop. Okay, and I'm gonna select everything in here and I'm and then control U to quantize yo this is sounding dope already and these are like pre-made chords already here in Ableton yo there's more chords in there okay so I found this other chord here I'm gonna go ahead and record that in Just like that, that's simple. And I'm gonna go ahead and select everything in here. And I'm gonna go ahead and quantize. So now I can see a little bit more. What the hell is that? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and record this. Okay, there we go. So I'm gonna again quantize. And there's actually a filter cut off here by the macros. <laughs> Big shout out to the dude who actually corrected me when it came to these macros. I didn't know what to call them. I just, I'm used to calling things switches and knobs and that kind of thing. So I'm going to like show automation and I'm gonna do this, boom, boom. And I'm gonna do that so that it builds up a little bit. So I can use A to switch back to show the automation and you know, uh, to, to take them out. That kind of thing. Okay, let's see what we can do now. Maybe now we can throw in maybe some mallets. Okay, let's try this. Oh, that sounds beautiful. That sounds sweet. Okay, now let's throw in maybe a bass or something like that. Okay, now we're talking, now that sounds super nice and special. Okay, I think something like that is a nice bass. This track is coming along, man. Let me know down below if it's coming along. I think it's coming super nice. And then next, what I think I can add is, let me see if they have maybe some loops I can use. Okay, this loop sounds nice. I like the clap, but I just don't like the hi-hats on this loop. The hi-hats, they're a bit too much. So I'm looking for a loop. I'm looking for a loop that doesn't have like, like too much of a hi-hat. Okay, I think I found one that's kind of nice. I think this one works. This is in kind of my style. Okay, this is how it sounds. This one is perfect. And then now what I can do is I can drop in like some drums. Okay, let's try this one. Ooh, 
Ooh, this one is nice. This kick C78, I think that sounds nice. I think I'm gonna delete this sound here. I think I don't like that sound. I think what's missing in this track is something like a lead. I think I can throw in a lead. So let me go back into synth leads. Let me try this one here. That sounds super sick. Like I love it when I can jam out and play like a nice super lead that, that that can really fit in with the track. That's how I know that the idea came together. But let me know down below what you think about this idea, and let me know what you think about Ableton. Uh, you can follow these videos along if you, uh, you if you feel like Ableton is daunting. I'm also you know just checking everything out and uh, going through the ropes. And if you have any tips for me, down make sure you drop them down below of anything that I could have done better or anything like that. But if you're new here, make sure to subscribe down below and also drop this video a like i'm gonna definitely do more videos like this as long as you guys are enjoying these kinds of videos